Hi, it's Mrs. Richardson. I'm back with another math lesson. You ready? We're going to count to a hundred this time. And you know what? I'm going to count as fast as I can because I don't want this video to take all day. Let's get started. Ready, set, count with me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. When I get to the end of a row, I have to go back to the beginning and down. What comes after 10? 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40. 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60. 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70. 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80. 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Phew! I bet if you wanted to, you could probably count to 100 all by yourself. Maybe you should do that later. I'm going to take my yellow crayon here, and I'm going to color all of the numbers that have a zero. So let's start looking for zeros, okay? Do you see any zeros through here? Hmm, maybe I should do it like a book, reading left to right across a straight line. Maybe that'll help me search the whole chart better instead of just going wherever like this. Let me start on the top. Zeros? Oh, there's a zero, but it's part of a number 10. If I cover up that one, I see a zero. So there's a zero right here. Any other zeros? Five, six, there's a lot of ones in this. Oh, there's a zero. A two and a zero. Okay, let's keep looking for zeros. You know what I'm noticing? I'm noticing that there's no zeros on this side and that I'm getting some zeros all right here in the same line. Let me check down that straight line and see if there's zeros in that straight line. A one zero, two zero, three zero, four zero. We were right. Four zero. And another one. Five zero. That's a fifty. What is six zero? Sixty. Seventy. Mm -hmm. Eighty. 90. Oh, two zeros down here. That's a double zero. Two zeros right here. And a one in front makes it 100. Now we're going to try counting all the numbers that we colored yellow. But first I'm going to check one more time to make sure there's no more zeros anywhere. Do you see any? I don't see any here. I see some up here. But those aren't the ones we're looking for. We're looking for the ones inside the red squares, right? No more zeros. Okay, now that was loud. Let's count the ones with the zeros, just the ones that we colored yellow. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. I'm going to do that one more time, straight down. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. That's called counting by tens. We're counting by tens right now because each row has 10. There's 10 here, and there's 10 here, and there's 10 here. So after we've counted a whole row that has 10, we say 10. And then another row of 10 is 20. And then another row of 10 
is 30, just like full 10 frames, like what we did yesterday with my 10 frames over here. You guys remember these. A full 10 frame is counting 10. Well, I'm also counting 10 right here across the top line. There's 10 in each line all the way down. If I wrote 10s all the way down, there's 10 in each one. So counting by 10s goes like this. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. We're going to count by 10s. Can you tell? That's what we're doing today. I'm better open it all the way up. Okay. On this page, they did what we did. They colored all of the dot, all of the squares that have a zero in the end. And they're showing you what I showed you. We're counting by tens. There's 10 in the first one. And after we count the second one, it's 20. And then it, another 10 is 30. So this one has 10, and this one has 10, and this one has 10, and this one has 10. Look, I can count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There's 10 in each one. And so when I count all of these groups of 10, I don't say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. In fact, if I tried to count all of them, it would take a long time. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. It takes too long. Let's learn how to count faster. We're going to count by tens like this. This is a group of 10. Another 10 is 20. Next is 30. Another 10, 40. Another 10, 50. If you notice, when you count by tens, it counts up just like when we were counting one, two, three, four, five. And the ones column stays the same because there's no extras. There's one group of 10 and no extras, two groups of 10 and no extras, three groups of 10 and no extras, four groups of 10 and no extras, five groups of 10 no extras. Six groups of 10 and no extras. Let's go slower. I said 10, 20. Aha, we're counting by tens again. What comes after 20? What was my first missing number? It was number 30. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, what comes after 50? What comes next? 60, 70, now two missing numbers in a row. I said 70. You tell me the next two numbers that come after 70. After 70 comes 80 and 90. We're learning to hear the numbers as they count. I remember a song, 10, 20, 30, goes like this. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. One more time. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. That just helps me hear the numbers and helps me count them again and again. Now, I have a question for you, and that is, when you look at these, does it make you think I should start counting with number one? Let's try it. I'm going to close my pen and use a pencil instead because I don't want to mark it up. Here we go. <sighs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. That was a lot of counting. I kind of got out of breath. Oh, 
So was it 20, 30, or 50? I forgot the number. Should we go over and start again? With number one, I think there's a faster way to do it. How many was in the top row? How many was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There was ten in the top row. And look, they're all the same length. They're all the same size. That means the next one doesn't have any more and it doesn't have any less. It's the same. So that means this one will also have ten. And that the next one will also have ten. If we have three tens, a ten and a ten and a ten, how many is that? Let me check my chart. A ten and ten more and ten more. Remember the song? 10, 20, 30. Aha! 10, 20, 30. How many did we have? 30. Let's do that again down here. Counting by ones, one at a time. One, two, three, four. Counting by tens. Let's count by tens. Okay. First, I got to make sure that there's 10 in the first row. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There is. There's 10 in the top row. And the top row is the same size as all the other ones. That means none of them are longer, none of them are shorter. They're all 10. So I have a 10 and a 10 and a 10 and another 10 and another 10 and another 10 and another 10. Okay, I'm ready to count. Do you remember the song? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. We're ready. We gotta sing it slower though. I'm gonna write the number on the other side down here. For each row, I'm gonna write a 10 number. 10, 20. How do you write a 20? A 10 is a one and a zero. A 20 is a two and a zero. 10, 20, 30. 30. How do I write 30? A 10 is a one zero and a 20 is a two zero. And so 30 is three zero, just like I can see right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Zero, 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 zero. Okay, I know what to do now. Each time I count by tens, the number right here, the first number, goes up by one. Ten, twenty, thirty, what comes next? Forty, fifty, sixty. What comes next in the song? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Aha, uh -huh. I found my answer. It's not 40, it's not 60, it is 70. Okay, here's a hard one. First, I gotta make sure that there's 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, are they all the same? They look like they're all the same. None of them are longer, none of them are shorter. So that means each one of these has 10. They each have 10. I don't have to write 10 every time, but it's helping me remember because I'm still just learning. Okay, ready for the song? You sing it first, no help from me, and then I'll write it. Ready, set, I'll hum the song, go. What number did you say? I'll help you. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Do you know what comes next? 70. If you forget what comes next, just look at this number. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What comes after seven? 
and a zero. See all these zeros? We're counting by tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80. That's number 80. Not 90, not 100. We're zooming, guys. We are zooming. Okay. We're going to count the tiny cube trains. Oh, they want us to write the numbers on the lines. Silly me. I've been doing that all along. But first I should check how many's in the first cube because they look like they're all the same length. None of them are longer and none of them are shorter. But I need to make sure that the first one has 10 because what if it only has five? Then I can't count them by tens. I have to count them by how long they are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. It does. It has 10. They're 10 long. So I don't need to write 10 on the sides because I know that they're all 10. On this side, let's write the numbers, okay? What's the first number? 10. Keep going. 10. 20. Keep going. 30. 40, 50, 60, which number is 60? 60 has the number six in it. 60, 60. This is the number that shows me a six inside the 60. That's how I know what 60 looks like. We're almost done. Hey, another one. Let's count by tens. Well, wait a minute. What if there's only five? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, there's ten. Now check. Are they all the same length? They are. So I don't have to count all of them because it would take me too long to say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. It takes me too long. We can go faster if we count by tens. Here we go. Ready, set. Here we go. 10, 20, 30, keep going. 40, 50, 60. Oh, that's how many we had over here. What comes after 60? Well, after six comes seven. So after 60 comes 70, 70, 80, 91. Hundred. Look what we found. We found one hundred. We found one hundred. Yay, 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 yay. Look at this. You're going to get to write the numbers in order. So here's your big chance, Lance. It's your chance, Lance, to put your numbers in order. Now, Here's what I'm gonna ask you to do. It's a little bit tricky, but I think that since we've been doing this together, that you're gonna be able to do it. I'm gonna use a, um, a I'll use a, a crayon, because maybe you have a crayon at home. I'm going to start, hmm, how can I do this? I wanna make sure that we do it the, well, we do it well. Here, can you see that? I'm going to start with, um, if I draw 10 circles, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, I'm going to be drawing circles all day. Let's instead make a long rectangle. Looks like a stick. Let's make a rectangle that looks like a stick. In fact, it doesn't even have to have the circles inside. It can look just like this. And let's tell everybody that inside that rectangle, there's 10 cubes. We know that there's 10 cubes because there's because we're the mathematicians right now. We're the ones making the key. And we're saying that this has 10, okay? I want you to make 10 rectangles. One, two, uh-oh, I'm going to run out of space. Three. I better make them small. Four. 
five, six, seven, eight. I got to fit two more. Nine, ten. Okay, I drew ten rectangles. And if I need to, I can even count them like this. One rectangle, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten rectangles. On this side, that's where I want you to do your homework. That's where you're going to write the number counting by tens how many blocks there are. Because remember, inside each of the rectangles, there's how many? There's 10 inside. So this one would be 10, 20, 30, and now you fill in the rest. I'm not telling you anything else. 